Hey everybody, I am going to show you today a pretty cool feature that a lot of us have been begging for. So we're going to go ahead and click on Instagram post just so I can show you. Um, I'm actually going to do this with a few different colors, but we're going to work with some text. So um, just grab some text and here you can see that they've uh, kind of started you out with this, right? So we're going to click on cheers and drag it and make it a little bit bigger just so you can see how cool this is. Okay, so now I am going to highlight cheers and I'm going to click on effects. So you can see that we are going to change this to neon. Um, let's click. This. hold on go back to effects and you can change the gradient or intensity here of that cheers kind of cool to give it a background um, splash there and um, we can do glitch I really really like the glitch I think that it makes it 3d and pop out of your screen and you can um, change that right there to the the two different colors you can also tone it down a little bit change it a little bit with this um, direction uh, and the offset so you can make that bigger and stand out more uh, very very cool uh, you can also go to echo so um, echo is exactly that you can change it all around with this and the offset. Make it just subtle, right? That really gives your, um, your text a pop when it comes to viewers and how they're going to see your content. The splice, I love this one and I love the hollow. And then uh, you have lift and shadow and you can go back to none so I want to show you when you uh, click on the background and we're gonna go ahead and make this black and then we will let's make this yellow so let's highlight this and go back to effects and see what happens when you use a color or different colored backgrounds. Pretty neat, all the fun stuff that you can do with this. Uh, again, it just makes everything pop. Um, the cheers, that's a little much, isn't it? Let's pull that in. But look at that 3D effect that you're getting. The cheers, let's go back to uh, zero. Offset. I'm trying to pull it, reel that in a little. That one didn't look as cool, did it? Cheers, lift. I don't think lift does very much. I don't even know what it does, but it doesn't do a whole lot for me. And then um, I really like the shadow effect for just something nice and subtle. Um, very, very cool. Uh, and then we have our little text over here. So even your, your smaller, um, you know, kind of subtext, it just really puts a pop to that. Let's make that white and show you what it'll do to just some simple text. It just looks beautiful uh, to give it that highlight and that 3D um, texture to it. So this uh, feature should be rolled out to everyone uh, at this point. Um, but they have so many different, let's click off of that, so many different templates here to get you to try it. So I'm going to right click and delete, right click, delete, and then just take this uh, love you text. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful, isn't it? Um, but again, that neon, or how about wow, so fun.
to be able to use all of these different highlighted um, texts or let's say you have a sale you can take what they have and do sale right click whoops we want to delete ungroup I'm trying to ungroup these two words there we go sale so now you can just take the one that you wanted and let's say I wanted to make this 400 I'm just gonna make that a little bit bigger it doesn't want to pull but pretty cool I love it you can put fun sale that over there and even curve that how fun, right? Okay, so I just wanted to show you that this um, text over here, there's so much that you can do. Oh, look at this one. Um, so many things that you could play with uh, over here. Just ungroup uh, to be able to edit these, you know, individually. But there's so much that you can do over here with all of this uh, fun little text that they have um, over here on the side.